one? Australia. Another one? Hi, mate. Who can guess? Yeah. Eh? America. Uh -huh. Canada. Germany. Yeah. Belgium. Oh. So it's. Eh? Portugal. <laughs> okay. So quite. Okay. Go ahead. Go ahead. So it's in Europe. It's not the United States, not Canada, not Australia, not Asia and Africa, but it's somewhere in Europe. I may give you a clue. So in my country, we speak German, Dutch, and French. So we speak three languages, German, Dutch and French, and we live in Europe. So, which country? Say again. Which one did you say? No, that one. What did you say? You say it. Yes. You say. You say what? No. You say that one. No. There's a country. Somebody say here. You say that one. Okay, one student found it. He said Belgium. Hey, well done. So, what is your name? Good, my girl. Clap for him. Okay, so let's shift to the actual lesson, right? So, this is the country where I live. That's in uh, Europe. It's near Germany, France, uh, the Netherlands, and the UK. And this is why, where you live in Kenya, okay? So today, we'll take a closer look to the human body and more specifically, the inside of the human body. And we, inside our body, we have organs. And you already guessed the stomach, but is there anybody who can tell me the name of another organ? So please, can you tell me the name of one of your organs. Lift up your hand and you say the name of one of your organs. Say it loudly. Lungs. Uh, the the lungs, yes. Take, take, the speak, take the speaker, the microphone. What, say that again? Lungs. Lungs. Look. The lungs, very well. Lungs. Very well. Another person? Just say loudly from wherever you are saying here. Yeah. Stomach. Stomach. Say loudly. Very well. Somebody else? What? Liver. The liver. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Heart. And you the say heart. Your right. You need to use the mic so that you can. But, but uh, Coin, you can hear them? Yeah, I can. A little bit. Okay. Just, just give the mic first. Yeah, they are recording. Okay, who else there? Uh, take the mic. Brain. The brain, very well. Okay. So, an organ is a part of an organism which is typically self contained and has a vital function. And actually, um, two or more organs are working together in the execution of a specific body function and they are called body systems. And although we may look different on the out outside, we all are equal on the inside of our body. So do you know one of those body systems? Like the brain is part of one body system and the stomach and the heart are part of another body system. Do you know, can you tell me one body system in your, uh, in your body? One body system in your body, who would like to try? Okay. What? Brilliant. Yes. yes, so what's your name? Philip? Yeah, Philip say breathing system. Very well, yeah. Another one? Another one? Yes, please. Yes. 
Your name? Your name? Are you system of my body or our body. We have digestion system. Di digestion system. Very well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Very good. Say your name. My name is Sister Nancy. I would like to say one system of my body. Uh, one, one of the systems is circulatory system. Circulatory system. Very well. Yeah. Well done. So, indeed, today we are going to focus on a few of them. And actually, let's start with the skeletal uh, system. So, how many bones do you think we have inside our body? How many bones in the skeletal mm -hmm. system? Who wants to try? How many bones do you have in your body? Mifu Pangafi, how many bones? Mifu how many bones do you have in your body? Uh -huh. In the front here, give it, let it, for the mic. Pick the mic. Say your name and the answer. My name is Daniel. Mm -hmm. We have the eight bones. Eight bones in the eight body? Bones. Eight A little bones bit more bones. than eight bones. Yeah. Yeah, is it eight bones? A little bit more. Yeah. Yeah, a little bit more. Can somebody else try? Let's try it with yeah. Let's try it with bones. Nine, nine bones? Nine bones. No. Yeah. Still more bones. They are far much more. They are far much more. Eh? So much more, yes, indeed. <laughs> <laughs> it's more than the 100. Oh, ah, she has only two bones. <laughs> okay. Okay, one more guess. One last guess. Who wants to try? Yes. Okay, um, my name is Vanya. According to my understanding, I only have four bones in my body. Four bones? I have only two, and two hands and two hands. Okay, <laughs> two hands and two legs. So, two bones. <laughs> Any other person want to try? Four bones? Four bones. Okay, okay. that's the small. You have to say four. This one, one, this one, one. Another person? <laughs> There are many, that's what we have been. The clue is that there are many. There are many more than that, yes. One person there. Can I say your name? My name is Vanya Dev, and if I'm blessed to say that I have many more than 100 bones. More yes, than 100 bones? Exactly. And I love the discussion, really. Right? <laughs> that's okay. really great. But in fact, we have 206 bones. 206. 206 bones. Yes. And Angelina, Angelina wants you to count them for her. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So the bones in our body, they give the support and the protection to vital organs like the brain and the heart. And it serves as the place for muscles to attach to. Yeah? And it's also the center of product production of uh, red and white blood cells. So actually, without the skeletal system, without those bones, our human body would be kind of really floppy and limp. So. Some facts about our bones. Uh, did you know that the hands and the feet contain over half of our body's bones? So in our hands and our feet, we have 100 bones or more. Okay? Did you know that only your hands and your feet have more than 100 bones? Okay. Are you taking Perfect. Okay. The second one is the muscular system. 
and we have about 650 different muscles which help us to move but also for the blood flow and other functions in our body we have three types of muscles the skeletal muscles which are connected to the bone yeah and they help us with uh, the movement but we also have inside organs uh, the smooth muscles and they help to move some substances to, uh, through our, our organs and the heart muscle is really unique in our muscle uh, muscular system because it's made of smooth uh, muscle okay so how many muscles do you think we have already gave that away <laughs> how many muscles somebody can get it <laughs> Yes, give him the mic. Say your name. My name is Francis. Hey. In our body, we have six muscles. Six muscles, Francis said six. Somebody else want to try? I want to get that question, but I don't know. According to me, we only have three muscles. Three muscles? <laughs> <laughs> I try. I'm Peter Magat. Mm -hmm. I have 650 muscles. 650 muscles, Peter? Great. Perfect. Correct. So we had our skeletal system, the muscular system, then the third is the digestive system, including the mouth, the stomach, the liver, the small and the large intestines. And they basically work together to convert food into energy, okay, to feed the entire body. And All right, that's the digestive uh, system. So when you take an adult's intestines, they're really, really long. How long do you think? How long are an adult's intestines, which are those over here? How long uh, is an adult's uh, intestine? How many meters? How many feet? Who can try? Your intestine. How long? Yes, yes your intestine. Yes. How long are they? Seven centimeters. Seven centimeters. Seven centimeters. Okay, interesting. It's a bit more. A bit more. <laughs> Okay, anybody want to try? Yes, your name? My name is Daniel. I know that this, we have the 25. Okay. 25 feet? 25 meters. 25 meters. 25 meters. Uh -huh. Somebody else want to try? Yes. By the name here. We have 25 feet. 25 feet. Perfect. Perfect. 25 feet. Very well. 25. Which is seven and a half meters. Yeah. Okay. Okay. The next one is the circular system, which includes the heart, the blood, the veins. And this is vital for fighting diseases and maintaining a proper temperature in, in your body okay so the main function is to transport blood and nutrition oxygen and carbon dioxide and also hormones okay and did you know that life in space affects the circular uh, circulatory system so i wonder how many people have been on the moon do you know 
how many people have been on the moon during the past 100 years and more? How many people have been the moon? On the moon, yeah. Those who are doing geography, yes. Do you, you want to try? Okay. I give the mic to the, the influencer here. Yeah. Check, check the mic. How many people have been to the moon? By the name of wood, but I would like to try. Mm -hmm. There are two. There are two people. Two people. Two. That's what I thought. Two people. But it's more, more than two people. Yeah, more than two, two people. Any other person you want to try? Yes. And? Yeah. The name name what I would like to try. Yeah. There were four. There were four people? Mm -hmm. It's more than four. Yeah. yeah. Four. Surprisingly. Somebody else want to try? One and four. Yes. Twelve people. Twelve, perfect. Yeah. Ah, congratulations. Twelve Americans. Okay. And I only know for two days actually because uh, last week one of them died. That's why it was in the newspaper basically. So otherwise I wouldn't have known myself. Okay. So 12 people. Okay, so we had the skeletal system, the muscular system, digestive system, circular system, and then we have the nervous system, including the brain and the nerves. And the nervous system controls your body, okay? And it sends signals to different parts of the body, including the brain and the spinal cords. So when you poke your neighbor, he or she will feel this thanks to the nervous system. Okay? And it tells you your body when to drink, when you are hurt, etc. Okay? Did you know that the left side of the human brain controls the right side of your body? And the right side of your body controls the left side. Uh, so I'm sorry, the right side of your brain controls the left side of your body. Did you know that? Did you know that? Did you know that? No. We of your brain controls the right side of your body. Did you know that? Okay, what do you think? The right side of your body controls the, the right side of your the right side of your brain controls the right side of your body or the left side. <laughs> the left side. And the left side of your body controls which side? Right. The right side. Okay. Perfect. The last one is the respiratory system, and this allows breathing. Includes the nose the windpipe, the lungs, etc. Okay? And do you know why we are sneezing? Is anybody in the classroom sneezing from time to time? Do you know? Do you know why, you're why you are sneezing? Yes or no? Do you know why you are sneezing? Do you know to sneeze? Yes. 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 Has anybody been sneezing today? Yes. <laughs> Who is that? <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. Is it? Why are you sneezing? Yes, I know. Uh, try, try, take the mic. No, I said it. Why are you sneezing? You know. You don't know why you're sneezing. Any other who can try it? Why do you think you're sneezing? Who can jump here? Why do you want to jump here? Try. Because of the dust. Because of the dust. The dust. The dust. Yeah, basically it is. Yeah, it is to blast out germs and unwanted uh, intruders outside of our body. Yeah, and the velocity is estimated that uh, of a sneeze at one hundred eighty kilometers per hour, which is one hundred and twelve miles per hour. 
Yeah. So now we are going to we are, we are go, going to take a closer look. So what can we connect to the nervous system? Is it eating or breathing, moving, protecting, feeling or distributing? Uh, where can we put the nervous system? The nervous system is this first one. Yeah. And the answer is idea. So nervous system, where can we put it? Eat, breathe, move, protect and support, feel, distribute. Which one? Anybody want to try? You lift your hand and try. Name? Yes. Major? Try. The nervous system is the way it protects the body and support. Yes. The nervous system protects your body and support it. Anybody else want to try? What what would the nervous system help you to do? Yes. Mm -hmm. Can help you to feel. Perfect. Yes. Thank you. Correct. Correct. Yeah. Okay. The next one. The circular system. Circular system. Yeah. Somebody wants to try. The circular system will help you to do the what here. Yes. The name. The name is Ayati. The circulatory system can help us to distribute blood. To distribute blood. It's to to, to distribute. Okay? Yeah. The circular system. Uh huh. Clap for her. Very well, very well. Skeletal system with our bones, including our bones, the skull, etc. Uh, the skeletal system will help us to do what? Eat, breathe, move, feel or distribute or protect. Who wants to try? Yes. The skeletal system will help you to protect and support. Perfect, thank you. Well done. Correct? Yeah, Not correct. Fine. And the fourth one is digestive system, yes? Um, by the name Aja, the digestive system can help us to eat. Digestive can help us to eat, correct? To eat, Not yeah, fine. correct. Correct. Yeah. Respiratory, the last one, the second last one. Who want to try? You just say. Another person? Yeah, somebody who has not spoken. Yeah, go ahead. My name Dario. I know I know the the perspiration system can help out to breathe. Yes, correct. To breathe. Correct. Well done. Correct. And the last one, muscular. Anybody want to try? Somebody want to try? <laughs> Muscular system help us to move. Is that correct? Right, correct. Perfect. Well done. So when you play soccer, which systems, which body systems are you using for being able to, to play soccer? Soccer, who wants to try? Whichever Vira. Which system do you use to play football? When we play soccer, we use muscular system. We use muscular system. Is that correct? Correct, yes. Yes, And another one. So it's more than that one. It's more than that. Yeah, more than that. You use also another yeah. one. It's also another one other than the muscular system. The system. Another one. 
when you are playing football, you use muscles and words. You want to try? Yes. Which one? Which which system? Yeah, behind you. I don't know. 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 I don't well, basically, it's right because we have to drink, right? We have to eat to have sufficient energy for being able to play soccer. Yeah. You are also correct. Good. So that's correct, yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, correct. We need our bones, right? For being able to move. Well done. Another one. Another one. Who wants to try? By the name, use nervous system that have feelings of playing. Use nervous system to have feelings of playing. Yeah, and to think for being able to think. Okay. Yeah. To think. Being able to think, think how to play. Clap for half. Another one? Is there another one that you use for playing soccer? There is no baby. Right, right? This. I think we are the respiratory system. Of course. We need to breathe, right? <clears throat> So we need to okay. breathe. Uh -huh. Correct. And maybe we our heart needs to beat as well, or not? Yes. Or not? Yes. Does it? No. You have to beat for you to play soccer. Yes or no? Yeah. Yay, so we need all our body systems for being able to play soccer, right? So I don't know a lot of soccer, but who is this guy? Yay. <laughs> Which country? <laughs> and this one? Yay! This one? Beckham, right. Is it Beckham? It is Beckham, yeah. Beckham, correct? Yeah, correct. Yeah, correct. Well done. This one? Wow! <laughs> you guys are experts, right? Garrett Bale from Wales. These guys are fun. Ida Nazar, yeah. He is from Belgium, you know. The last one? The last one? Correct. Well done, guys. This is Lukaku. Congratulations. Okay, so that's all. I hope you learned a bit about your body and I want to thank you. Did you learn about your body? Yes. Anybody took notes? I was taking notes. Yeah, did you take notes? Um, notes. Did you take Nobody. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> Six systems. Oh, very good. Okay, one person was taking notes and would like to tell us the system that uh, they were able to learn. Can you, can you tell us? Right. Hey. Shamil. Shamil. Uh, I was right down system here. 
which is a digestion system, mm -hmm. nervous system, breathing system, circulatory system, respiration system, respiratory system, and skeletal system. Great. Congratulations. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Okay. Okay, Mr. Coyne. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you. And for the good lesson, the, the students have learned something. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we hope to continue with this. Yeah. Uh, with the sessions from, from this point. Uh, I would like to give a chance to Joshua to, to, to just say bye and uh, close the session. Okay. Thank you so much, Sixes, and uh, Moses as well. Thank you so much. Thank you. Hi, Quinn. Hi. I don't want to see me from that uh, point. Okay. Yeah, Thank you. Um, Thank you, Joshua. Yeah, we're, so happy. we're so happy with that uh, session. I'm really happy. And I'm sure too. Our, our are very, very happy. And uh, we hope that uh, we will have more sessions of the same, at least with people learn us and become better people in the future. Thank you so much. Very wise words, yeah. yeah. Yes. Thank you so much. Otherwise, uh, I'm glad to have uh, uh, Black with you uh, during this session. And I, uh, I'm sure our alumni are also very happy. Maybe they just say hi. Hi. Bye bye. 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 Thank you so much. Bye. bye. <laughs> okay. Thank okay. you very much. Thank you. All right, good. Okay. So hold on a little. Uh, don't run away. Okay. Okay, fine. Yes. Uh, thank you so much. We'll keep in touch. We'll okay. Okay. So is that Moses there? Huh? No, Sixtus. Oh, no, Sixtus. Hi, Sixtus. Um, yeah, I just want to say that. Oh. So is Moses there for a second? Yeah, you have stepped out, but the cameraman is here also from filming. Yeah, is Moses there? She wants to ask something about... I just about, want to ask uh, him about the interviews, that's all. Just to speak to him for a minute. Uh, I'm saying Moses has stepped out briefly. Oh. Okay. But the, the, the cameraman from Filmade is here also, if you want to...